Well, hello there, YouTube. Welcome to Sunday the 21st, if you can even hear me in all this wind. My little wind socks I built for the camera have wore off, so uh, they don't exactly work anymore. Mama's out there feeding horses and the puppies. And I'm coming out here to get the automobile out for her. <laughs> Whew. It's only 5 o'clock in the morning. Oh man, that wind has been fantastic. It's 48 degrees out here. It's almost like a spring storm or something. It feels great. Well, it feels fantastic out here with that wind blowing. It was rushing through the shop here for a second until it's button knocked the door off the hinge over there. It's crazy. Good thing that's a big heavy duty door because that was one heck of a bang. Yeah. Abby, what are you doing out there? Yep, them dogs, they catch all these smells going through the air. They love it. All right, let me get your vehicle out here, Mama. All right there, little woman. Be safe in all the wind and blusteriness out here. I know. Yeah. Did they? Yeah. That's all I need is a power outage. I know. That Yeah. All right. All right. Be careful. This thing handles the wind a whole lot better than that element. Yeah. So you'll be safe. All right. All right. I see ya. Bye. Big woman's running off and leaving me again. How do you like that? Hey, Abilene. All right. It's just me and the dogs again. <laughs> Man, that would really suck to lose the power. <laughs> Not that it hasn't happened many times out here. Well, check this out. It's one o'clock and uh, it just stopped raining about 15 minutes ago. And look, it stopped raining. I see little patches of blue. And I just got a text that the little woman's home. She's home early today. They must have finished the inventory. Can't believe that. Oh, look at all that back there. Oh, yeah. <laughs> the little greeting crew here. <laughs> they never stop playing. sure if the camera focused on that or not but that was way cool so the little woman she's taking a nap <laughs> I'm standing out there in the front porch whispering like she's like I'm gonna wake her up but uh anyway I got a little errand to run while she's while she's taking a little siesta found something really cool you guys are probably gonna like this wouldn't you know it I've been wanting to do this all day since early this morning, since before the stores even opened, I found something on a website. It was a smoking deal. And at first I didn't succeed, because they're gone. But I did find something else that's just a little different. Same thing, we'll just say it's different in a big way. I'll just leave it at that. We'll get to it. But I'm gonna drive clear thing near halfway to work well it looks like for once Toledo has the nice weather ever since I've hit the freeway it's been pouring down rain and it just seems to be getting worse the farther I get south kind of a rare occurrence hmm. wonder what I could be doing here again oh sportsman this is a bad place but they had something kind of cool going on. It looks like I might get the last of something here. So I need to not mess around and get on in there. Told you that was a bad place. I had to cover it up a little bit because it kind of gave it away. But there's something right there in that box. You're going to like it. Or maybe you won't. <laughs> I like it a lot. Yep. Even days when I'm out roaming around by my lonesome. 
The old Honda needs gas. I can make it to work and back tomorrow. But <laughs> I just don't like stopping on Mondays for anything. Mondays and Fridays, you just gotta cycle your fuel stops. But it happens. But I uh, figure I'd just go ahead and top her off and not have to worry about it till Tuesday. Very excited with what's sitting in that front seat over there. <laughs> coming went to Kelso and apparently I just brought all that rain back up north with me it was all sunshiny and beautiful when I left here earlier so I'm sure you guys are dying to know what I picked up at, at Sportsman's <laughs> I'm sure you probably got a good idea you remember in the running I narrowed it down to two two units the MMP Shield, 9mm, single stack, you know, the Shield. And then there was the uh, Springfield Armory XDS 9mm, the 3.3 barrel. That was the, the two that I battled back and forth. Well, good thing I decided this because that 9mm doesn't exist. <laughs> Not around here anyway. Um, Sportsman's had a huge sale and basically flooded <laughs> flooded the market with them apparently smoke and deal on them at any rate I'm glad I didn't side on the Springfield because I wasn't gonna get it and I look at all their stores all the way up into Seattle and down into in down towards Salem zero don't exist I did find one XDS 3.3 but it's not nine millimeter And the reason I went shooting down there is this is literally the last one anywhere. The guy at the store says, you know, we can look at our thing and see when a shipments are coming. They don't even have anything. And he goes, they're obviously not going to change anything, or they could. He goes, but surely they'd have heard. They always hear about new models coming before they're even announced. But you guys notice that normally these things, if you watch any unboxings of any of the XDSs, um, they come in a pelican case looking type plastic case. I saved another 60 or 70 bucks, or maybe it was 50, 60, whatever it was, by getting, this is the only one they had, and it was called the envelope soft case. And so I saved an additional $60 or $50 by getting it without the, it didn't matter, this is the only one I was going to get if I was going to get one. So saved extra. But there's kind of a kickback. You even save more than what you're thinking you save. First of all, let's reveal what's inside here. Ta -da. It's an XDS. But if you can read that, you guys probably heard me talking about how I love 1911s. I'm a huge 45 ACP fan. The XDS 45 ACP 3.3. And the 3.3 just denotes the barrel length. There's a 4.0. There's none of them either. This is wicked. I'm a huge 45 fan. And I don't know why I didn't even think. I, I got to looking into this thing and I found out that this is literally the same size in every way. Obviously bore is different. And the amount of rounds it can hold in the in its single stack is different. But same dimensions as the 9mm. In fact, it's so much uh, for all the So anyway, this is what's really crazy. Here, let me get this out of the way here. There's the two you get two magazines. Two magazines. If you guys ever watch this, you get the flush mount and then one extra round. In this case, it's a 5 round clip, 6 round clip. You get a second six round clip not clip magazine you know growing up around a bunch of guys everybody called them clips I know it's a magazine and oddly enough I'm the one that corrects them half the time and I just got to I turn that camera on and it becomes a clip <laughs> magazine I clearly know the difference if you need to know the difference yourself if you don't know Google it it 
pops right up. Um, but anyway, these are virtually the same size. The M&P Shield 9mm and this XDS 45. Is that crazy or what? There's a slight difference in length. If I can do this, I don't know. I can't. I'm, the camera's above me, so I don't know what it's seeing. Slight difference in, in length between the two. And the shield is slightly taller. Ever so slightly taller. Five millimeters, maybe. But virtually the same size guns. Nine millimeter. Smith & Wesson. And a 45 millimeter Springfield. This is all U.S. made. This is actually uh, made by um, H H S in Croatia. Known for, I mean, they're legendary for their guns. But anyway, Smith and Wesson is partners with them, and they're building these uh, X D S. All the X D line, in fact, the entire X D line. And if you've done any research on these things, they're crazy reliable. I don't know, technology or whatever. I mean, you know, Glock had the stronghold on that. And there's uh, equal contenders nowadays. You know, not that I don't love the Glocks and respect them. But uh, there's other choices now. And that same type of striker fire gun. But anyway, that's what I went rushing off to today. I can't wait to get out and go plinking. I don't know if that's in front of the screen or not. XDS 45 ACP 3.3 Smith & Wesson M&P Shield 9mm Model 2.0 The newest version. Very nice. And no, I'm not concerned about the grip safety. I've been a huge 911 fan forever. I, that's not even something I think about. Cool stuff. They even come down the same way. One lever flips up, this one flips down. The sequence is exactly the same. Really cool. Very excited. It was one of those deals I just I couldn't pass it up. So I shot down there and got her. <laughs> Alrighty. Look forward to some uh, reviews in the future. This is kind of just a quick unboxing. Alright. We'll talk to you guys later. These are magazines, not clips magazines they have the spring and stuff in it look look up the definition it's contained a clip you know what a an old m1 grand is where the bullets slide onto a clip then it goes in and all the spring and stuff is down in the magazine you put the clip in the magazine so i apologize if i said clip a few times so anyway way cool stuff well, hello there, YouTube. Welcome to uh, a long lost out in the on the porch vlog. Yeah. Booting by vlog. In the dark, in the cold. Heck yeah. Well, I hope you guys had a wonderful day today. It uh, got a little bit. It's like off and on rain yesterday. You know, when I went on the ride, it still got wet. Today, boom. Other than when Kelly came home and I took off for uh, Kelso to go to Sportsman's. That was nice there, but as you've seen, <laughs> about halfway there started dumping. Yeah, it was crazy windy yeah. and rainy. Oh yeah. Lights were flickering this morning. I haven't looked at any of that footage. It's still on this camera. I don't even know. That's probably all, all you hear is wind blowing. I need to redo my little microphone wind socks. That's Leo sniffing under the door. Because if you hear I that want out. Psh, psh sound, that's, that's Lee Lee McGee. We didn't bring him out with us. I guess we should have. Yeah. As long as he's not barking or howling, we're good. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but he even breathes hard. Yeah. Goofy old butt. But anyway, that was a lot of fun. That was a uh, man. That was a deal I couldn't resist. God goes, you know, you've gotten three guns in the last two weeks. I said, ah, no. <laughs> it just one of those deals. And I was looking at at them anyway, and I didn't realize that there was. You know the sale that Sportsman's had, and that must have got people revved up because all the local shops are around here. He goes, oh, I don't know what's going on. We just had a big rush on them all of a sudden. They weren't on sale at those shops, 
But uh, the, I think sportsmen ran out and people just went crazy and started grabbing said, them everywhere. I gotta have it. Yeah, but anyway, got one 45 ACP. I love the 45 ACP. Uh, just always been a huge favorite of mine. But uh, so now I got two of them that are virtually the same size. It's pretty crazy. Uh, she's gonna have Kelly's going. That thing's really gonna kick. Yeah. Yeah. She's she's gonna have a wallop to her. That's for sure. But from what I've read and, and stuff, when I just started waiting for Kelly, because I wasn't going to go out in the motorcycle and it rained, so um, I started just doing massive reviews on the 45. I did all the stuff on the 9mm. Uh, did the 45, and uh, everybody goes, it's not bad. You know, I don't know how um, Springfield managed that. Or HS, whatever it is in Croatia. In there. Yeah, it's a dual springs, but you know, it seems to be pretty common nowadays, but. It works. You smell good. Do I? Mm-hmm. <laughs> Watch I keep, yourself, woman. I keep smelling your <laughs> Hmm. <laughs> keep your mind. Yes. Anyway, um, okay, I probably went long on that on that little mini review thing there, so we're gonna cut it short and then uh, relax for the rest of the weekend together. Yeah, a couple hours uh, and then work tomorrow. Yeah. Yeah. Back to the old grind. All right. Thank you guys so much for watching. We really do appreciate it. We will talk to you tomorrow. Same smoke time, same smoke channel. Don't forget to give her a thumbs up and have a wonderful Monday or Tuesday. Heck yeah. Back to the old grind. Yep. <laughs> I never left. <laughs> yeah, Kelly's going. It's <laughs> just one mean? continuous two weeks for me. I know. All right. All right. All right. So we'll talk to you guys tomorrow. Thank you guys very much. You guys take care. All right. Bye-bye now. <laughs>